Hey guys and welcome to That Was History. I'm Jeremy Payne and I'll be hosting this segment with a pretty life-changing story. So does the name Clarence Gideon ring a bell with anyone? Well how about this, let's just say you committed a crime, but you didn't have enough money to afford a lawyer to help represent your side of the case. What would you do? Do you think you're actually entitled to one? Well nowadays we have the right to a lawyer no matter the circumstances, whether you're guilty or not. You have the right to seek counsel on your behalf. Well this was not always the case. You see, if you didn't have a rich uncle and you were poor as dirt, then you just didn't get a lawyer because you couldn't afford one in the first place. Well imagine if you got busted for breaking into some place. Do you think you would need an attorney to help you get out of trouble that you were in with the least amount of punishment? I think so. It was because of this man's case that it was ruled that a fair trial cannot be underway if a poor man doesn't have the access to a lawyer. Due to this, every criminal, no matter how bad of a crime they've committed, is entitled to one. Now this doesn't mean that you get the fanciest one in town and doesn't mean go commit a crime just because you'll get a lawyer and might be able to get out of what you did. It simply means that the cases can now be fair because the person being charged with such crimes will have a fair counsel on what to plead for and what to say that will not get them into a deeper hole than they already are in. So remember the justice system was not always what we know it is today. It took trial and error to correct things to make them fair. Even the jury part of a trial was not always around, but that's for another day in history. If you like what we had for you today, please hit that like button below and also follow us on our social media sites and we'll see you next time guys.